Entia niya me bi unko ye wo nipa ni abefo ntem. They look for it and they find out what is actually working against man and then God. Entia niya me bi unko ye wo nipa ni abefo ntem. This how things are not working well between man and then the witchcraft. Or come for a human. And that is the work of the idol worshiper or priest. Why things are not working well for men and God? And that is the work of the prophet. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. Today I'm going to reveal something to you about my prophecy. Amen. 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 And I have dived deep into it. That I had to go into the Come. spiritual realm. <laughs> Amen. 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 When God revealed it to me. I saw a Christopher Pimpi Musu. That many Christians are lamenting. So I asked him so Yankopong, that God Almighty so for so why are Christians weeping and wailing too much? And God answered and told me that and I'm the that this is Kowa what I'm going to tell the answer is what I'm going to reveal to you today. Praise him. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Now, eh, Sometimes it amazes me. It's it God is, in the spirit of flesh. Do we worship God in the spirit or in the flesh? Ah, it is a If Christianity is about worshiping in the spirit, then I am a young man. Utie, and you. Na bosso moa isi hua ye hono. Enu moma beji ya entitle hong hong mosso sun sumu viasi. Na ye moma ye mfebi binsi ya nem. Na ye free ya hong hong mosso no ye moma te hona mo. Na wangwa wangkure kure ni aman sani ya jedi no. Wang moma beji sun sumu viasi abosso. If Christianity is a worship in spirit. Then why is it that we Christians that we worship a God and on seeing God we do operate in the flesh? And then these idol worshippers who worship idols that are physical and molded with hands, they operate in the spiritual realm. This shouldn't be so. We are supposed to operate in the spiritual realm. So when we talk of the spiritual realm, then that should be our daily lifestyle of Christians or believers. It should be the revelation and the secret of a Christian or a believer. It should be a secret between a Christian and the God he worships. And that is the spiritual realm we are talking of. Well, what do you see today? We have allowed these idol worshippers and other traditionalists to take our titles and then to be operating in where we should do. So if I said I dive into the spiritual realm, then it should tell you or speak to you that that now you are taking over. We have taken over. Amen. Amen. Na Bible aka se nyame ye honhom tesese ye som ne honhom. For the Bible says that God is spirit and we must worship him in spirit. And to was me and ma and sa and sa and dore ye na mom ye ma de honhom no and dore ye en se ye ma. Now we should not be so much focused on the things of the flesh or this worldly stuff that yeah. we should be filled with the spirit and yeah. not be filled with wine. Exactly. So, let's talk about things in the spirit. Are you ready for some Psalms? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Come. Say no, soon 
In the spiritual realm, I've already spoken to you on so what your mind. That when we talk of the spirit, it is the instance of what dwells within you. Now, when it comes or emanates from your mouth, it turns into your speech or your voice. And that is where the problem or issue is. Please let's go and read the scriptures. Uh -huh. Ye ask. Ye ask. And receive not. And receive not. Because ye ask amiss. Because ye ask amiss. That ye may consume it. That ye may consume it. Upon your last. Upon your last. Amen. 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 Say problem, Nanny. This is the problem. Now, my country did that say Bible moon semi nigh a baby. And I've spoken to you countless times that what you see in the scripture are always with 